Hello, it's Solimik. In today's video, we will be replacing engine filter and the cabin filter on this 2021 Nissan Kicks. I already got both filters. Let me show you where they are located and how you gonna replace them. The first filter we'll be replacing is the engine air filter. Here is the filter box located on the driver's side. Release the clip and it comes out just like this. By the look at the air filter, it's never been replaced before. When the air filter clogged like this, the engine will have difficulty to suction the required amount of air and then the engine will burn more gas. When you're putting the new filter in the filter box, make sure these rubber lips in the front, sliding in the tabs and then putting the clips on. Alright, we are done with the engine filter. Let's move on to the cabin filter, which located under the glove box at the passenger side. We just need to remove this cover and then this plastic piece folds up we can pull the cabin filter out. By looking at the filter, we can see it's been damaged and compressed during sliding in the filter. When the filter stays like this for a long time, it will let all the dirt get in contact with the evaporator and it will never filter the air. I had same scenario with another car, which resulted to have almost clogged evaporator. I did a detailed video where I showed how to clean that evaporator at home and get rid of that smell and clean that evaporator. Video link will be in the video description box below where I showed how clean that evaporator from this to this. Here is the new filter. The arrows should be towards you and then it will slide in just like this. This car has very bad design for the cabin filter. You have to be very careful when sliding in the new filter and fix all the wrinkles so it covers all the evaporator and not stay bended like this. Otherwise all the dirt will end up on the evaporator. I just made sure that I fixed all the wrinkles and the filter sitting flat. Now we can close the cover. And the last thing, we're gonna put the cabin filter cover back on. Just make sure when you're sliding in the cabin filter and fix all the wrinkles so it cover all the evaporator and not staying bended like this. And that is how to replace cabin filter and the engine filter. Hope you guys found the video useful and learned something new. If it was, like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.